Hi again. Welcome to Daytime Ottawa right here on Rogers TV. It's a pleasure to have you here. I'm Dylan Black. He's an Ottawa inspirational artist, has had the chance to travel to Paris, London and New York for concerts. Pretty cool. Let's find out more right now about uh, Ryan Ofe joining us. Hello, Ryan. Hi, David. Hi, Dylan. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> Good to have you here. Campus Rush Music. Okay, so tell us about Campus Rush. So Campus Rush um, is a church, um, and it's a youth ministry uh, started by my best friend in the city of Ottawa. And, um, yeah, basically we have music, we have uh, theater, dance, a whole bunch of things. It's an expression for young people who are just looking to find out more about our faith. Wonderful. Now, how did you get started in the music business? Um, I've been singing since I was about, like, four years old. I used to tell my mom I want to sing, um, and then she actually let me one day, and my dad uh, gave me some keyboard lessons, and here I am today. That's wonderful. Now, the new EP is out, David's Heart. Yes, sir. How many songs do you have in this EP? Uh, so it's an EP about, of about five songs, and um, it's really awesome, really reflects my heart, and um, I think people would really love to hear it as yeah. well. Can I ask you who David is? David is actually, it's actually my middle name. Uh, yeah. So it's kind of like a play on words. Uh, David is obviously the character in the Bible, King David, mm -hmm. um, and it's also a middle name that I have, and so I really found that I really identified with uh, who he was to be able to be the king, but also to be able to be someone who just loved uh, God and to like make music, and so that's really... That's why I identify with them. Yeah. Well, I did uh, introduce you as an inspirational artist. Yes, so, what does that term mean to you? Yeah, inspiration uh, simply just means um, introducing positivity into this world. Uh, there's so many things um, from society or around us that are negative, and inspiration really just says, "Have you tried this perspective? Have you tried looking at the sun being up instead of it's hot outside?" You know. Mm -hmm. and so, Okay, so uh, you have traveled uh, across the globe, as I mentioned. Um, uh, tell us about some of those uh, travels. Yeah, so um, just I've had the privilege of traveling a bit. Uh, I've had the privilege of just traveling around the world, and it's uh, it's been pretty good. Um, it's from all the way from Europe to Africa. Hmm. Um, I'm just sometimes I'm shocked at where I've been. So it's been really good. Um, just really being able to share the music and just share the love. Um, people are really receptive as well. And so what is one awesome. of the biggest uh, crowds that you performed in front of? I'd say the biggest crowd um, would be um, in London. Uh, we did a program at the O2 Indigo uh, with wow. our friend Emmanuel Smith and. I walked out and I was like, this is a lot of people. How many so, people? I'd say like probably 3,000. Okay, yeah, that's a big crowd. Yeah, yeah. All we're, right. We're working. <laughs> tell us about the message that you want people to get from your music. Um, I really believe the message behind my music is just to uh, never give up. Uh, no matter what it is that you're facing, no matter it, what it is that you want to achieve, uh, just to continue uh, because there's a reason why you're on this earth. And beyond there being a reason, there's someone who's helping you through it as well. And so that would be my main message to anyone and everyone who's hearing this. Strong message, for sure. Uh, where can people check you out live in concert? Yeah, anywhere. Oh, in concert. Um, every every single Thursday, 156 Cleopatra, so that's my home church, TLC, uh, and that's where Campus Rush is held out of as of right now. And so um, every single Thursday, 8.30 p.m., even coming up, we'll be having a lot of programs and a lot of concerts as well. So that's great. People should come through. You're joined right now by a young man on keyboards named Clayton. Yes, uh, uh, the name of the song is Jehovah. You wrote this? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I wrote it and I had the privilege of working with Clayton. He produced a lot of the music and he's he's phenomenal. And so I'm excited to be able to share it with you. Mm -hmm. And I ask people to check you out as well on the line on your Instagram, uh, yeah. Ryan Ophi, uh, 400,000, or make that 4,000 followers. 400,000. You're I on like your way that. to 400,000. <laughs> yes, I believe so check it. Check them out. Uh, the name is, uh, the song is called Jehovah, and this is Ryan Ophi to, Thank Ophi you so to much, play Dylan. for us right here on Daytime. A thousand words would be enough to sing the praise of my Savior.
Jehovah. 